Financing loans and mortgages. How to buy a property here in Dubai if you are a non-resident. So I actually am creating a lot of these Lucy Real Talk videos and you can check out the other ones before now. They're all the yellow, bright yellow thumbnails. So I'm creating these thumbnails as a direct result of your feedback and your questions that I get asked the most by my clients that call me um, and obviously want my help to find a property here in Dubai. So today's uh, little live video here is really to clarify, can you or can you not borrow money from a bank if you don't live here, if you are not a resident in Dubai? Now, up until quite recently, it was not easy. It wasn't impossible, but it was not easy. However, things are changing radically. And as we all know, Dubai is really rising on the international real estate platform. Uh, more and more people are interested in diversifying their real estate portfolios out of the West than ever before. And as a result, there's more of you than ever coming here to Dubai to buy real estate. And how you're used to buying real estate is, of course, leveraging with the banks. Whereas here in Dubai, we have not done that in the past. So can you borrow money as a non-resident? Well, the, ask, the answer is yes, you can. And the good news is you can borrow up to 60% loan to value on a property as a non-resident. We're talking non-residents in this video, okay? So what does that mean? And is that possible for everyone? So it needs to be a property over a million dirham. I don't sell anything for less than 2 million dirham and you wouldn't want anything less than 2 million dirham because most of you as non-residents are also coming here to avail of the golden visa anyway. So what documents do you need? I'm just going to read from a list. So excuse me as I look down. So of course you're going to need your passport so we know who you are. Um, you're also going to need the last three months statements from your bank account in your home country. Also, the latest utility bill uh, for where you are living right now. So that is as a non-resident. Um, also, if you're coming here as a business owner, then proof of ownership of your business and or a salary certificate as well. So these are the requisites for the banks. And then what happens is when I'm working with a client, so if you're coming to me and you want to purchase a property, you know, we put you in touch with our extended team. So my extended team, for those of you buying and selling with me, uh, involves mortgage advisors, uh, conveyances, lawyers, people to do handovers and snagging and property management. So that's all part of the package when you choose me to purchase real estate here in Dubai. So the mortgage advisors will look at your requirements, look at what you're wanting to purchase, and they will match you with the right bank, okay? So even if you decide that you are from one bank in the world and you want to get a mortgage with that bank and you're not sure if they will loan to you, the answer is that the mortgage advisors will find the suitability. They'll work out which bank will offer you the best package, more importantly, the best rates, and then take it from there. So that really is to clarify for those of you as a non-resident. Now, if for any reason you cannot get your, your financing from the banks, and there'll be many reasons why not, maybe the, the there is no eligibility, the paperwork doesn't work, different countries have different um, requirements, etc., then what most of my clients are doing is that they are buying a property on a payment plan. So what is that? So these are properties that are not ready. They're not finished, they're under construction. And in Dubai, we refer to this as off plan uh, because it's off the floor plan, right? You cannot see what you're buying. You're buying from a piece of paper. And I've done that twice here and next door in Oman was very, very happy with my, both my properties. So it's very normal to buy off plan here. So then what happens is when you're buying off plan, you are buying with a developer. So the developer is kind of acting like the banks, right? They don't charge any interest. Um, of course, buying property in Dubai, there's no taxes or income taxes or anything. So you're simply buying the property price that they have, okay? And then you go on to their payment plan. And it's as simple as that. And I've got other Lucy Real Talk videos here that talk about the payment plans and how that works. But essentially, say I said to you, okay, you are buying a payment plan on 50-50. So what that means is that during construction over three years, you will be paying 50% uh, of the property price. And then at handover, when you get the keys, you will need to pay the remaining 50%, you'll get the keys, 
and you'll get your property. So that's a 50-50 payment plan. Now, if you're really lucky and there's not so many projects anymore, but get in touch with me. This changes by the day. We've got new launches coming up. We've got one tomorrow, which is really exciting. Um, you may get a post handover payment plan, which is amazing. Because imagine if I told you you have a post handover payment plan of 70-30. So what that means is you pay 70% during construction of the property. Then you get your keys so you can move in or you can rent it out. And then you have a further two years post handover to pay the remaining 30%. So as an investor, well, as anyone really, ideal on the cash flow, that's what everybody wants. That's, you know, back in the day when real estate wasn't going so strong here, we had a particular project, I'll never forget, and I regret that I didn't buy it now, where you could buy a property on a 25, 75% post handover payment plan. Can you imagine? So you paid 25% for three years. I know, I can hardly believe it. You got the key, and then you had another three years to pay the remaining 75%. We don't have such payment plans anymore because Dubai real estate is so in demand. There's people moving here from all across the planet. However, we do have a couple of post handover over payment plans, not so many, but even a, pa a payment plan as a non-resident that really helps you to, to get in the game, to get your foot on the ladder here in the Dubai property market. So do like this video if it was a value, it gave you some kind of information that you may not have been clear of. Um, I would love to help you and your family with your property purchase here in Dubai. So in the description below of this video, you will see my WhatsApp number. So just pop me a WhatsApp and I message and reply pretty quickly, unless of course I'm asleep. Um, we're entitled to sleep as well. <laughs> um, and then also we will be in touch and I can help you. So do subscribe to this channel, my YouTube channel, and uh, press the little notification bell so you never miss my future videos again. And of course, I really appreciate feedback. So if there's any videos that you'd like to see, that you'd like to know more about, then do also get in touch. And thank you so much for your support on this channel and uh, have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.